with all the latest in news, sports, and entertainment. You're watching the Boone TV Buzz, Iowa's most watched high school news show. Hello Boone High, and welcome back to the Boone TV Buzz. Thank you for joining us for this week's news show, where we will bring you all the latest in news, sports, and entertainment from this past week. Let's take a look at what has BHS buzzing. The Boone Community School District Library has received a tasty new opportunity to promote reading in our schools. I have more on this story. This year, Boone High has the opportunity to participate in Chipotle's Reading Rewards program thanks to District Librarian Mrs. Schuler. I applied for Chipotle Reading Rewards in January and what it is is a way to promote reading in schools and so I applied for our whole district and what we are doing at the high school and the middle school is I'm asking students to take their selfie with a book and then if they email that to me they can have a coupon for buy one get one free entree at Chipotle. So reading is cool and all but why are we taking pictures with these books? So the purpose of this is to, first of all, promote reading, but second of all, to allow students to recommend books to their peers. I will be putting the selfies up on the screens in the two libraries, and so kids, when they come in, they will be able to see their peers' recommendations. Um, and I, I will also throw them up on the Instagram site, a few of them. Um, and especially at the high school, this is nice because I am in all five buildings, and so there's not always someone here, and this way someone always has a recommendation. Be sure to email your selfies to Mrs. Schuler to receive your BOGO Chipotle coupon and follow the library's Instagram at Toreador Libraries and use hashtag Toreador on Instagram. This has been Tyson Kroll from Boone TV. With only several days left in his high school career, Brandon Rouse is eager to move on to the next chapter of his life. Boone TV's Kale Nave has more in this senior feature. There are so many great seniors this year, and Brandon Rouse is one of them, taking classes to prepare him for the future and having fun while doing it. Brandon Rouse brings a spark of enthusiasm to the classroom that impacts every single person in the room, teacher and students alike. He's a fantastic writer, he's a hard worker, he's a great member of class discussion. While seeming to have his life planned out and on track, he still manages to make time to play sports and be involved throughout Boone High. Brandon Rouse, after having joined as a sophomore uh, two years ago, has uh, grown as a tennis player extremely quickly. And uh, for that reason, he's one of the main things that he brings at this point is competitive uh, talent as well as um, just a competitive uh, attitude and motivation. Even though this is Brandon's last year, he is hoping to make this one of the best. Last Tuesday, May 7th, BHS honored the graduating class of 2019 at the annual Senior Signing Day. I have more on this signing day. Last week on Tuesday, May 7th, Boone High held their annual College Signing Day for seniors. The signing day allows seniors to sign on to the college of their choosing in front of their peers and a few photo opportunities with proud parents. Senior Jasmine Stairs used this day to sign for Iowa Central Community College. I chose Iowa Central Community College because of the low prices that they have and because it's only about an hour away from home so I'm able to commute home when I miss my family. While choosing a college can be tough, a few seniors let us know what influenced their choice. I picked DMAP because it's uh, cheaper than all the bigger schools and it's closer to home so it'll be close to my family and uh, it seemed like a great school when I was looking over it. We're going to Kirkwood to be with the boys. Go Eagles baby. Now as the class of 2019 prepares to move on with their futures, they can do so knowing that they bring all their gifts to all of these lucky colleges. This has been Tyson Kroll from Boone TV. One week ago today, the boys' tennis team hosted the Creston Panthers at their senior night meet. I have more on this recap. It was a rainy celebration of senior night for the Boone boys' tennis team as they took on Creston. In the number one singles match, Boone's Connor Patterson took a fairly easy W against Creston's Walker Patterson. 
O'Connor made good use of his quick feet to show Walker who was really in charge, and finished the match 8-4. At number 5 singles, Boone's Brandon Rouse took the win against James McDonald. Brandon was able to keep good control on both sides of the court, taking this win 8-1. With Boone sweeping the singles matches, we head into doubles. Ryan Hulse and Kale Nave teamed up to take on Creston's fifth doubles team. These two didn't let the rain stop them as they took the victory from them, finishing 8-2. It was a very good day for Boone. Despite the weather, the boys did not let up and squeegeed Creston right off the court, finishing 11-0. This has been Tyson Kroll from Boone TV. Two weeks ago, we had the honor of watching Marvel Endgame. Our one and only Joey Wilsack has more in this movie review. Hey Boone, hi, I'm Joey Wilsack and today I'm here to give you my reasons why you should go see the last movie of the Marvel's Phase 3, Avengers Endgame. Avengers Endgame is the latest Avengers movie for a big group of the actors involved in the, these films. It revolves around the fact that the Avengers failed to stop Thanos in the last part of the, mo of the story, causing half of the universe's population to disappear into dust as the Avengers deal with the fact that they have failed to stop Thanos. From killing half of the universe, which includes some of the people closest to them, they also try to figure out how to defeat Thanos and bring all of the people they care about back. Starting at number 3, we have the length of the movie. With the movie being a little over 3 hours, it allowed the movie to start slow and as the movie's pace quickened, it was able to tie in some of the bigger plot points throughout the Marvel Studio Universe. Bring the this phase of the Marvel Cinematic Universe to an epic conclusion. With number two, we have all of the cameos of celebrities and past characters. Besides the heroes you already know about, there were also some other characters and celebrities that made an appearance in the movie. This was great because it made the movie more fun as you were trying to find the characters and the celebrities that were in it. And my number one reason it, to go see this movie is that it's the last Marvel movie with all of the original Avengers. Like I said before, this movie is the last for a lot of the original Avengers like Robert Downey Jr. and Chris Evans and several other people. While this is sad, it could be great as well because with them leaving, it opens up a lot of slots to fill in the future with future characters. And those are my top three reasons you should see the Endgame. And I have loved this year 3,000. So thank you, Boon High. Kale Nave has been running around our beloved school asking what kind of business some of our BHS students would make. Here's the fan favorite question of the week. Question of the week. Question of the week. Man, I wish I could create a business. Boon High. If you could create a business, what would it be? If I could create my own business, I would create a company that would make kids actually put away their cell phones when they're hanging out with each other and talk face to face. Oi, get off your phone! Hey. Uh, I'd get loans from people, they give me real money, and then I'd give them back counterfeit money. How much money you owe me? You owe me five dollars. I want my money right now. If I could make a company, I'd make a water company, sell water, because you got to stay hydrated. Stay hydrated, y'all. Oh. Now that's what I call a quality a tool. Oh. Question of the week. Question of the week. Thank you for joining us for this week's new show. We will be back next week with all the latest buzz at BHS. In the meantime, please head over to BoonTV.com to check out all of our latest videos. While there, don't forget to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And now from all of us at BoonTV, make sure that you stay safe, stay cool, and have a wonderful week, Boonai.